Welcome back to more action with the Heartland Wrestling Association. I'm being joined in the ring right now by a young man that I know very well. He's one of the HWA standouts. He's been a World Wrestling Federation developmental talent for over two years now. And Steve Bradley, you have yet to reach the main stage in the World Wrestling Federation. And I know you've got to have some comments now that HWA is on television. You feel that it's about to be your time. You know, Jim, first of all, I just want to come out here and thank you for the opportunity to speak for a minute. You know, opportunity is not something that Steve Bradley has seen very much of in my life. Where I grew up, downtown Boston, Neyland Street, the combat zone, opportunity was not something that often came around. See, I didn't have much growing up, Jim except an alcoholic father who liked to use me for a punching bag and a mother who had to work two jobs to make sure that I had lunch money going to school. But you see, Jim, just like every good coin, there's a flip side to that. And in this invasion thing going on, WCW is that flip side. You see, guys, if you want to come in here and try to take my spot, you got another thing coming. You see, when you were in the power plant, where they used to grow wrestlers like grass. I was in Puerto Rico trying to avoid spark plugs that fans would throw at me. I was in Memphis winning every single title that came my way when you guys were on Monday Nitro getting your opportunity. Well, guys, you think you're gonna walk in here? I've been on the developmental contract for three years. You are not gonna take my spot. And if you wanna get if you guys want to get where I'm going, the line starts behind Steve Mofo. Oh, wait a minute now. Hold on. I'm seeing Mike Sanders and Mark Chendrak chasing Jeff. This is Steve Bradley's interview time. I don't know what the... Wait, wait a minute. This is Steve Bradley's interview time, Mike Sanders, and I don't know whether you brought Jendrak and Jet out here to cause some trouble or not, but you have your time allotted later on in the program. We've already heard from you to begin with. Maybe maybe you don't know who I am, Jim Cornette. I'm Mike Sanders. Steve, I'm Mike Sanders, former WCW commissioner, former cruiserweight champ. Now before I are these your bodyguards? Now, before I get started, I'd like to introduce Mark Jendrak, former WCW Tag Team Champ. Now, I'd also like to introduce you, the man going up for the HWA World title tonight, Mr. DZ Money, Jason Jett here. And don't be surprised if there's a title change. But there, let me tell you something, Steve, that's why I'm not out here, okay? I'm out here to talk to you man to man. Now. You've had an opportunity to make some decisions here. Now, last week at Jillian's, you dropped the ball. You didn't pick it up. We were fourth and 40, and you didn't run with it like you were supposed to. But you know what? As all good coaches do, I'm going to put you back in the game. I'm going to give you another chance to pick that ball up and run it in for a touchdown. See, I want you to be part of the WCW team. I mean, is this, this an offer of membership? This is an offer to come on over to solid ground. You know, you, you've got a good future with us. HU, HWA is not your future. So, with that being said, we extend open arms. Come on over, Steve. We want you on the team. And I take it you... I take it you can hear what the folks in the uh, audience think of your offer, and this is his uh, this is his award for joining your group. One of your T-shirts. Yeah, exactly. We're gonna put this on him, Steve Radley. We're gonna make you a superstar. Steve, what do you got to say? The ball seems to be in your court. You hear what they think. Jim, I do hear what everybody else in here is saying, but I am a man who thinks for himself. I've always been that way, and you've known me for a long time. So you guys came out here, three guys on one, to ask me to join WCW. So correct me if I'm wrong, 
I guess this looks like a situation that if I decline your offer, you guys are gonna kick my butt. Something to that effect. Is, is that right, Mike? Right, I think you will. So, if that's something that's going to happen, Mike, because I think it is, I guess I'm just going to have to beat you to the punch. <laughs> Jimmy Cornette's bailed out, and I've got the microphone up here. As Gindrak, Jet, and Sanders start putting the boots to Steve Bradley. He wouldn't accept their offer. He told him that before. Look here, Sanders coming back with a chair right now. And here's Cody Hawk and Lance Cade hitting the ring. And they're cutting Sanders off and going to work on Jet and Gindrak. Cody Hawk and Lance Cade, tag team partners, certainly aren't close friends of Steve Bradley, but they are with the HWA. And right now, you see Sanders and Gindrak and Jet heading for high timber as Cody Hawk and Lance Cade are saving Steve Bradley's bacon. And there you have it. The invasion group has struck once again. Steve Bradley, the victim this time because he wouldn't join the group. We're going to have to take a commercial break, and we'll be back with more action right after this.